Tomorrow, Be'ez Hashem is going to be um, Pesach Sheini. I wanted to know my f- a few things about it. If people ate the actual matzah and the Koban Pesach, was it the 15th at night? And so why some people eat matzah on the 14th? And my second question would be if it's because people, and that the reason we do it on the 14th is because people shech to the Koban Pesach then, why don't we say, some people don't say tachnun um, mincha beforehand? I think, okay, so let's uh, you know, take that apart a little bit. Pesach Sheni, when the Jews were in the wilderness, they were told to bring a carbon Pesach. That was the first Pesach if they left Egypt. They were told to bring the Pesach offering, and several people were impure, and uh, they had come into contact with a corpse, and they could not bring the Pesach. And they came to Moshe and they said, why should we be left out? And God told Moshe that people who are impure when they brought the current Pesach on Pesach, the 15th of Nisan, they can bring a, well, actually the 14th of Nisan, um, they could bring a carbon Pesach a month later in ER on the 14th of ER, and they eat it on the 15th of ER, I believe. And his question is multifold, must multifaceted. There is a custom to um, eat matzah on the 14th, even though, but his question is, why do we eat matzah on the 14th if they brought the offering on the 15th of, of the year? And uh, the second question was about Tachnan. There's the, the, um, the part of our part of the prayers or, or confession service, uh, or a confession service and, or prayer. And uh, we don't say that on festive days. We don't say that. Most people do not say that tomorrow on the 14th of Nisan, just like the Ignatz on the 14th of Nisan. So the question is the same. They actually ate the, Kerb, the Pesach Sheni on the 15th. Why do they not say Tachanon on the 14th? Um, most people did say Tachanon. The, the, uh, most, the preponderance of opinion is that you did say Tachanon today at Menva, but you should have. Um, well, the reason why we don't say Tachanon the 14th is because the day of a Korban is a Yom Tif. And uh, uh, no matter what Korban the person with a sacrifice, when they bring a sacrifice in the Holy Temple, it's considered a holiday for that person. So those people who are impure and made the the the, the uh, sacrifice of Pesach on the 14th of year, for them that was a holiday. So now, we, even though we don't have that, but we still remember it as a holiday, and therefore a holiday, we don't recite the Tachna like Rabbi Bidim had said, since the day of happiness, and Tachna is the day of, of confession of sin. So we don't say that uh, prayer on a joyous day. So since this is the day of remembrance, and the, the day of remembrance was the Pesach, which was a holiday, so that's why we don't say it on, on the 14th. Therefore, since we are uh, commemorating that day on the 14th, so we eat the matzah then also, because the matzah was, was eaten together with the golden matzah, even though it was the 15th. But the uh, 15th, we're going to say Tachna on the 15th, so there's no, there's no remembering of Pesach on the 15th. Since the 14th, that's we're remembering Pesach, therefore we put the matzah together on the same day, that we're not saying Tachna because that's commemorating the current Pesach, so we made it all lumped together in one day of remembering Pesach. Not saying Tachna and eating matzah.